spend summer vacations as on-the-job trainees in the different departments of the business. This taught us that no task was too small for us to handle and introduced us to the concept of meritocracy. In our family business, rank and responsibility must be earned. You start at the bottom and you work your way up. And if you don't make the cut, you're out. While I am family, I am also a professional, like any other professional in Avoides, that is driven to lead, serve, and excel in pursuit of continuing the legacy that my forefathers have built in Avoides over the last century. In closing, I wanted to share with you five guiding principles for leadership and business that I have collected over the last 10 years. First is lead by example. Whether you like it or not, are aware of it or not, many eyes are on you when you are a family working in the family business. What you do, others will believe is okay to do. What you expect of yourself is what you can expect of others. Second, honor meritocracy. Give credit where credit is due and reward the right behaviors. Third, articulate your values and stay true to them. These are the pillars that define who you are, how you and other employees should behave. Fourth, have integrity. You will earn the respect of others when you remain true to your word and true to your values. And lastly, work in the service of others. In the words of Justo Ortiz, the chairman of Union Bank and a fellow Ateneo alumnus, you can do well by doing good. Said differently, when you and your business are guided by the pursuit of a greater good, business results will follow.